Hi this is Gary with MacMost Now. Today let's look at using Spotlight to search for files. So today let's look at an excerpt from my book The MacMost.com Guide to Switching to the Mac. In Chapter 5 I talk about working with files and folders and on page 84 I look at using Spotlight to search for files. There are several ways to search for files in Mac OS X. At the top right corner of every Finder window is a search box. Just type something in that box and the Finder window changes to a Spotlight window. Spotlight is just the name that Apple gives to the search functionality in the Finder. A Spotlight window is a Finder window that shows search results rather than the contents of one folder. Here you can see a Spotlight window with the results in the main area and the search criteria on top. You can view the results as set up icons or select the list view button at the top of the window to see it in the list. You can also choose to view them using cover flow. At the top of the spotlight window in addition to the search field is a set of buttons with names next to the label search. You can usually choose whether to search this Mac or the current folder that was selected when you started typing in the search field. You can also select contents or file name. The default is to search the contents of the files but sometimes this can return too many results. Searching by file name is better if you already know part of the name of the file and don't want results that also include that text as part of the contents of the file. When you have some results you can click on one of the columns to sort by that criteria such as name or kind. At the bottom of the window you can see the path to the file that you have selected. You can also click on the plus button at the right side of the Spotlight Criteria area to add another rule to your search. You can add as many rules as you want and change the rules as you need. Using control click or right click on a mighty mouse and you'll get a contextual menu with choices like open, open with, or open and closing folder. So that's just a look at the basic spotlight functionality. The next section of the book goes on to use the spotlight menu for even quicker searches. You can find out more about the book at macmost.com slash book. It's on sale right now in stores across the world and also in online stores like amazon.com. Hope you check it out. Till next time, this is Gary Rosenzweig with MacMost Now.